My name is Dirk de Prier and I'm the chief pilot for Namibia Helicopter Services at and beyond Sources Fleet Desert Lodge. We've got these beautiful red dunes and the scenery over the dead fly area is magnificent to see from the air, especially at, at nightfall where we get the, the different colors from dark purple to yellow and it's just magnificent. Obviously to see the 500 feet dunes drop down into the ocean, which is a must see in that area. Flying low level over the ocean, that's for me personally the best experience ever. We've got a bird's eye view, seeing this sea of dunes. You can see what, what's beyond the next dune from the air and obviously from the helicopter. With the doors removed from the helicopter, you just have this much better view of, of each little dune from star dunes, linear dunes, and obviously the petrified dunes that we get down at Sources Flat. The color change in the dunes from the dark red dunes which lie inland to the almost whitish uh, dunes next to the shoreline, which is difference in age of the dunes and then obviously the the magnificent 500 feet dunes dropping down right down into the ocean we've got one hour scenic flight which is uh, basically flying down to dead flay area uh, see that from above and then back to the sources flay desert lodge we've got the 90 minute flight which is from the lodge all over the dead flay area seeing some star dunes, some petrified dunes and then down to Black Rock where we've got the second largest seal colony that we, we've got in Namibia and we see that from above we have seen some penguins as well in the, in the past. The two and a half hour flight is the longest one which is a must do where we fly over the dead flay area down to Black Rock see the seals and then obviously low level for about 30 minutes up the coastline to the Edward Boland shipwreck which lies about 400 meters inland over the dune belt back to the Ambion Lodge. 